have uh, still a, a deeply marginalized and stigmatized First Nations, Métis, and Inuit population that we have a long way to go to reconcile and repair relationships with. But the foundation has to be respect, and respect only comes from understanding. And, and so we need to do a lot more in terms of Aboriginal awareness, um, talking about you know, not just saying, well, welcome to Treaty 6, but what does Treaty 6 mean? What does it oblige all of us to do as shared custodians of the relationship with the First Peoples of this land? We don't talk about that in our schools, and we should, and, and that's going to be introduced in the curriculum as part of the, um, the, uh, the learning about residential schooling, but we need to, and that's, historical trauma is an important part of the story that we need to address, but we also need to focus on uh, reconciliation and focus on resiliency and capacity building for those kids and hitting stigma uh, straight on because when I, and I'm, I'm always ashamed to talk about this but but when I um, went to on the one hand when I went to that uh, that YMCA daycare it was a super diverse group of people and my best friend um, his name was Carl I only later found out that Carl was black we were all colorblind like we just it was a very diverse group and it, it just wasn't an issue for us but as I, as I grew up, um, people become more aware of these, of these things. Labels get applied. And it was still socially unacceptable to be racist in junior high and in high school, except towards First Nations people. And it happened all the time, and it's disgusting. And we need to confront that, because to, to systematically marginalize a, a group of people like that um, is not good for the country. And it's not good, it's not good for us. And so there's a lot of work to do there around diversity and inclusion in our, in our classrooms for new Canadians and original Canadians. Um, and, and teachers have a role to play, in, partly in advocating for, for the things to make those people successful, and then to bring some sensitivity to, to the complexity of, of those interactions as well.